Hi, I'm Lamar. This is mirror.co.uk. So it's been a couple of years since we've seen you. What have you been up to? Um, I have been working extremely hard trying to make the new album, The Reason. Um, and also, you know, a little bit of a break. You know, try, I've done a little bit of travelling um, and, you know, just a bit of soul searching. Just, you know, letting life do its, do its thing. So, yeah, mm -hmm. that's what I've been doing. You went to Miami, didn't you, in Sweden? To yeah, I went to Miami, other. I went to Sweden, went to Los Angeles, uh, went to Denmark, did a little bit of a recording over here as well. <clears throat> it was a fun, you know, it was a really fun time. You know, I got to rediscover my passion for music, my passion for life. Um, you know, it, it was nice kind of recording the album at a slower pace than normal, you know. And I think as a result, I felt much more inspired during the actual process, you know, because I got to hang out as well, get to know you know, the different people that I was working with a lot more uh, closely. They got to know me uh, much more as well. And as a result, I think we've uh, come up with some, some songs that are, you know, very, very personal and have got, you know, a lot of meaning to them. She's so ready to give up and move on I don't think she knows How I wish sometimes She could read my mind If she knew how mentioned um, touring with Beyonce as well. How was yeah, that? Yeah, that was cool. That was cool. She's a nice, a nice girl. You know, it was great going through Europe and, and, and getting on shows, you know. I love France. I've always loved France because obviously I've gone over there and toured as well. So, you know, to go on, on the back of her show was great. She had an amazing live show as well. Like, mm. truly amazing. So, yeah, it's great. Did you get to hang out with her at all? Oh, no, no. There's, too, there's so much work. You're, you know, a lot of people think that, you know, when, when you go on tour that you know, you get to just chill, hang out, mm. jump on stage, you know, it's full on work, full on work. So, mm. I, I mean, I got to say hello and, you know, that was cool, but no, there wasn't loads of hanging out, no. Yeah. And you're also a, a dad now as well? Yes. How's that? Little girl. Mm -hmm. It's cool. It's really, really cool, you know. Um, it's everything that everyone said it would be and a little bit more, you know. Yeah. Um, I would recommend it to anyone who's of age um, uh, 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 to have us. It's just, it's just great, you know, it's like getting to know another little person uh, and it's a beautiful thing, yeah. And in terms of fatherhood, are you a very hands-on dad? Or do you get up in the middle of the night and change nappies? I try to be, to the best of my... We can only try. I try <laughs> to be. Um, but, yeah, no, wherever I can, you know, do my thing, I, I, don't, I don't see any of, it, any of it as work. Even, like, if you have to get up in the night, to me, you know, it's like... Like I said, it's another person who, in, in my life who needs that. So it's like, uh, you know, I'll do whatever, whatever needs to be done. Mm -hmm. yeah. Plans for any more? Not immediately, no. Mm. As beautiful as it is. Um, uh, no. <laughs> none, none, none yet. You know, if something happens, something happens, and it's a great thing. But, you know, just in, 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 in a very logic place in, mm. in my mind, n n not yet, no. I've got a lot of, of, of music and touring to do. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. So you were discovered on Fame Academy. Are you still a fan of reality talent shows? Yeah, I'm cool with it, you know, yeah. I think it's, it's, it's cool TV, you know, it's, uh, I think the, the only current one at the moment really is X Factor, mm -hmm. um, and I think, you know, it's fun to see people who think that they can sing and they can't sing at the beginning, and then, you know, if they end up with something, somebody at the end who's talented and, 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 and can get a shot of what they've been trying uh, uh, to do for, for so long, then I think that's a, a beautiful bonus, and someone else has got a chance to live, live their dream, so I don't mm -hmm. see anything wrong with it at all. Have you been watching this series? Uh, yeah, I've seen a couple shows, yeah. I've seen a couple shows, yeah. What did any anyone you tip to win at this early stage? I don't know about I don't know about winning. Um, I never get those things right. But um, I think I think uh, who I think Alexandra has got a very good overall package. I mm. think she's a good singer, looks good, you know, performs well. I think she you can see see that she's been trying for a while. You, if you were on it as a contestant, yep. who would you like to be mentoring you? Oh, um, if I was on it as a contestant, I don't know. Show she's cool. Yeah, she's been through what a lot of the people are, are going through. I think people sometimes underestimate the, the kind of pressure that, you know, that, that, you, that people have to go under in order to come through. You know, if you put your, what you've been waiting for your whole life on, 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 on the line with every single performance, I think sometimes people under, underestimate that pressure. Mm. And so it can be a bit flippant with, you know, with, with, with comments. But because she's been through it, she, I think, you know, she, she's, she see, the way she comes across and, you know, the things that she says, you can see that, yeah, she's someone who's sympathetic with that. So that's mm. cool. Yeah. 